Gina Page of AfricanAncestry.com and we're here today to discuss the African influences on African American fashion. I have Rita McGee, costume designer, with her sisters who are also costume designers and costumers. Rita, welcome. Thank you very much. And your sisters, will you introduce your sisters to me? This is my sister Elaine McGee. Elaine, nice to meet and you. And this is my sister Alita Bailey. Now, Rita, you are a costume designer. Mm -hmm. Will you please tell me what that entails? A costume designer is the person that sets the tone and the look of the show or the film. I tell the story through the clothes. What, what is one of the more memorable projects that you've had the, the good fortune to design for? New Edition. Yes. Absolutely. New edition. Yeah, that's the, coming the, up. Oh, right. New edition, okay. the movie. Okay. And then the pri prior uh, to that, um, Empire and Chirac. Mm. Nice. Well, I I am honored that you We're honored. took the AfricanAncestry.com test and, and gave us the opportunity to trace your DNA and find your roots. So can you share with us what we found for you? We traced your maternal line. So Rita, you took the test. Yes. I took the test. And the results are the same for all the sisters mm -hmm. and your mom and aunts and uncles and cousins and children and grandchildren. What did we find? That we are from Sierra Leone, the Mindy people. The Mende people Mende. of Sierra Leone. Mm -hmm. So how, how did that make you feel? So I had done a DNA test um, uh, previously, and I just got the percentage of the, um, you know, how much um, African American, European, Native American we had, and I knew that we originated from West Africa, but it really didn't pinpoint exactly where. Mm -hmm. I like to say that knowing how much African you have mm -hmm. is nice to know. Mm -hmm. I mean, we know mm -hmm. we're not 100% African, mm -hmm. otherwise we would be African and not African American, mm -hmm. but knowing where is what you need to know. Mm -hmm. how how do you see this information, your your knowledge of your Mende selves now, mm -hmm. playing itself out, either mm -hmm. personally and or professionally in your work? Um, I see it both ways. I see it professionally and personally that we're strong women. So those kind of things, I, I think that that's how I feel on how the ancestors like work through you. The DNA that you said has the memory, like the memory of the color and the light and how I could put it together. In terms of the looks that we're going to see a little bit later, what what kind of influences did you draw on for those? There really was something about femininity. And so this is just a little taste of it, you know, and this the cloth and the design and it, how it was designed from, you know, African hand. Mm -hmm. I think it erases all doubt and it gives me unshakable confidence on that there's such a continuity and that you can say, you know, one doesn't have to guess on where you are and what you stand and what your meaning or purpose. You go, this is it. Scientifically, it is proven. 